So it begins. I took three of uh, the Amherst uh, necks. So uh, I'm gonna wash this, clean it. Might be a lot of chemicals and stuff on it. And I'm gonna remove the fat. And then I'm gonna steam them. And I'm gonna select a few to color. Let's begin. So uh, I'm gonna start with some hot water. Some dish uh, washing fluid. And then I just drop the next there. Let them soak overnight. Just make sure they go down properly. I'm just gonna show you how it looks. So there we are. And I have the next down here. So I'm just cleaning them. I'm just gonna let them soak overnight. <coughs> Removing all poison and fat. So, day after, I soaked this Amherst next over the night. And have a look, all the dirt, the dirty water. So we are just gonna uh, clean them up and then I'm gonna put them on the paper to uh, dry out. So that's basically it for now. So I have to remove everything. What I can do meanwhile, I can cut off the head because I have no use of the head. Uh, so I have to find a scissor. There we are. And I cut off that part. And then I have the nice skin there. I'm just gonna put it on the paper and leave it for this to dry. Get some loose feathers that are dry up as well. I'm gonna use all the materials. So let's have a look here. Have a few small feathers. Nothing to use really, but on this one, of course, I'm gonna take care of the toppings. So I'm gonna pull them off. So I just keep them. Let's go to the bin. So we're just gonna wait for this to dry. It's gonna take a couple of hours. And then 
the next step is to pull all the feathers away and then steam them. So see you soon. Starting to dry up, looking quite well. And I took uh, the opportunity as well to clean some more golden pheasant. So I'm gonna prepare them uh, and put them on dry as well. So steaming Amherst then, <laughs> Amherst is quite soft, so uh, be, be careful when you're steaming them. There you go, let's take a bigger one. comes together quite nicely. So I have two whole necks to do, so it's gonna take some time. <laughs> 